Hello, I'm Andrew Lizzie, and welcome back to uh, Stellaris Synthetic Door 1.8.3 modded. Uh, Glob Glob Assimilators, our race of robotic fish. It's going well. We're currently at war with this big federation here. That as well. Um, not really having too much trouble. We've we've certainly put the resources we're getting to the test. Uh, we've actually cut down our mineral income by 50% over the course of the last few years, and our energy income has gone down massively. We are over fleet budget though, so. Quite a considerable margin, like 150. I think we're still building more Corvettes. Uh, just don't ask how long this list of Corvettes goes on for. It's a pretty long list. This is why we don't build Corvettes like this. Uh, anyway, somewhere we're busy declaring war and doing things. The other end of the list. Right. I believe we're currently having a ground war here. Planetary invasion begun. Well, that shouldn't be a problem. Oh yeah. Uh, we'll leave our forces here. It should decrease the unrest a little bit. It hasn't really decreased the unrest at all. Yeah, whatever. Meanwhile, take this place over. Construction complete. Then we can go a hunting. Also, stop building corvettes. Don't know what to do with them. <laughs> Put them in the fleet and get them killed. Yeah, okay, I know what to do with them. But I, it's just they're in the way, logistically. Can I have like a toggle of like not. It's 75 in this list. There's 75 things in this list right now. There were 80 something. Probably more complete. before that. There we go. Killing them off now. Bring the pain. Construction complete. Oh, hello. Fleet combat. Ah. Colony yeah. emancipated. Right, the invasion's over. Embark you. Follow you. We're taking on this fleet. Which we outnumber a lot. Once we've done that, we'll probably head down to... Here. Seems like fun. Right, who else is having a fun lark today? You're in a fight with a station. Um, you're bombarding something. You've got a fleet. Uh, sorry, an attached army. You don't have an attached army. Right, we need to go find you an attached army. There might be one in Redditor. There is one in Redditor. Excellent. In which case, transport fleet, would you kindly do some invading for me? Yeah, don't do that. You'll get really, really confused about going past a wormhole station and you'll have a panic attack or something. Like, oh my god, I don't know what to do! It's a wormhole station! Can you have, like, a panic attack? Well, I guess maybe there are robots that are meant to be super intelligent. I guess they could have one. Uh, invasion. Great. Yep, you've got that in the bag. Don't worry about it. You don't need input from me. Please don't need input from me. Um, you... Just group up. It's terrible grouping. And have you just been here forever, just preparing to jump? No, you must be new. Must be new. Where's the other group of... There we go. That's the other group. If you could just go to the center, it'd be so much easier. If the Corvettes could get out of the way. Should probably stop building them. I know, Ships I know. Upgraded. There's only 29 of them now. Aggressor colony emancipated. Right, you've upgraded, so... Group of you. You managed to emancipate a colony, good for you. Can you go blow something up? 3,000, not really enough for me to worry about. I will kill it, though. 
And then... I guess we'll come over here. Hello. You're a little bit outnumbered. Have fun. Sincerely, E. That's our fleet of destroyers all firing their main spinal mounts. And the corvettes are trying to get into the action, but they promise they started far back. And now the enemy's starting to melt. That shield is disappearing fast. I do want to have a look at their research, just in case they have, like, tachyon beams or something we can pick up. Because that would be an upgrade for us. Come on. There we go. We managed to kill a Bob class. Another Bob class goes. Another Bob class. All the battleships are gone. Bobs are melting. I think they jumped. No. No, I think they blew up. Construction complete. Yeah. We've got them all. We got them all. We got them all. We got them all. And we got them now. Bam. Alright, invade. Are you still waiting for your friends to invade? Yes, you are. Once we've done these invasions, we'll probably start splitting them into smaller groups so they can hit more targets. Particularly the one that I may have overpowered. System survey complete. Yeah, you got this. Planetary invasion begun. This one I'm more interested in. Warform. Assault Titan Ultra. Mega Warform. Oh, they're actually not doing as good as I thought they would. Yeah, they're, they're actually taking damage. I win this, I think. Just thought they were going to be a lot more powerful. Aggressor mm. colony emancipated. Got to say, a little bit disappointing in you. Ah. <laughs> Sorry, you melted. It's a known issue. My fleet does that to people. Yeah, these war forms are... a bit disappointing. Alright, do you want an extra war form group to come down and give you a hug? That can be arranged. Again, don't go that way because you'll get really confused going past some really innocuous settlement stuff. Like a wormhole. Got that. Uh, 3.2, really? We're going to play the, oh my god, 3.2k game. Right, where have we just invaded successfully? Here. Embark. This is the smaller fleet. I'm actually not okay with splitting the smaller fleet. We'll wait for the bigger fleet to be splittable. Um, what do we want to hit next? Pretty much everything is our oyster right now. This, yeah. Guess we're not going to have enough to really split the fleets, which is a shame. Unless I build a lot more, which is obviously the correct idea. Mega war forms for every um, by everyone. Again, I mean just me. I don't know why I say for everyone when I'm very, very, you know. What's the word? Um, when you won't share. Selfish about my war forms. Why did it take me so long to think of the word selfish? I'll tell you why. It is 4:15 a.m. I'm getting a train in 12 hours. I need to sleep. But I have work to do. And also Stellaris is fun. I like saying stuff like that with a deadpan face. People are like, you do mean it's fun, right? You're not just like brainwashed. So I like doing that. Ooh. Oh, I thought we had a, like a proper fight. I was like, ooh, look, lists of things. Oh, wait, no. that Their list is that long. My list is that long and more powerful. You will all die. It'll be fun. <laughs> blood for the blood god. Blood for the blood club. Right. 
How long until you want to peace out? Because you've got a lot of things to kill. Really? I have just wrecked you at every turn and... Really? Please tell me you've got like some sort of hidden thing up your sleeve which is just going to surprise and shock me into... You're attacking me with what appears to be like a single corvette. Nope, that's not exactly going to shock me. Nope. 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 A fleet of transport ships with no backup. What were we going to do? Obviously, we're going to get defeated. <sighs> going to have to think of some sort of mediation, maybe. Uh, once you're done here, I will split you up. You... Once you're done here, I'm going to split you up. I was going to try and produce as many war forms as possible. Might actually need to produce more than the ones we've got going here. A little bit disappointing, like I said. I guess they've got less than twice as much upkeep, so we can't expect them to be that amazing. Uh, I need to watch that, so just one second while I build my war forms. Important that we get all the war forms formed with war. Right now. Just a few war forms more. Ugh. Right, okay, what, what are we talking about? Oh. Bye. You did. It is a known issue around my fleets. I would say we're looking into it, but we're just laughing. Pointing and laughing. Something's giggling. Which is very hard to do underwater, but we've managed to pull it off. Frontier is established. I believe that puts us over the limit. Not in terms of alcohol. That would be very dangerous, being in charge of an intergalactic uh, nation, while also being drunk. Probably not the best plan. Needless to say, I can, however, purge everything on the planet. That's not an issue. Also, we should get humans here or something. Okay. And then for you. I ain't not done yet. Okay. Fine. Sector... What sector are you? You're not Mondak. You're Landcord. Nearly everything is Mondak. But that's the one in the north. As far as our galaxy has a north, I guess we've just arbitrarily designated a north. I don't want to select you. Uh, mm. There we go. Right. Now, where were we? Um, blowing things up with E. Certainly one of my, my more pleasur ple pleasurable, pleasurable pastimes. Uh, what are you doing? Um, you know what? Take a quick jaunt over here, because I'm pretty sure they're trying to take this back. No? Is it here they're trying to take it back? Here they're trying to take it back, probably. And then pop along to Pash. I don't think anyone's grabbed Pash yet. All right, armies are landing. Should be absolutely fine. Have you got troops coming? You do. And over here, group up. Send the commander over because it's it's a little bit awkward now. Do want to win this time. Eight war forms should do it. System survey complete. Right, land army. Oh hello. Yeah, it's a really, really dangerous looking outpost. New 
frontier is established. Oh, and that's another new frontier. And a unity pick. All the interesting stuff happening today. Uh, right, where are we? Hello. Good going on the surface. Do you want to get me a uh, human, eh? Not some terror. Got not for that. Got not not a fox. No. We want to get a human. Somewhere over here, they say. Oh, that's Lancord. It's not exactly a again. Those are foxes. We've been through this. There we go. Uh, you can grab one of these. You know, good for nothing humans. Chuck them over there. There we go. Now, I think you're good for me to be able to give you some orders. Standing orders are going to be, I don't know why, I've, I've changed to Irish and it was not Welsh at the time. There we go, back to Welsh again. Uh, Lancord, if you could do me a favour. I, I don't even know. Just switch between all of them. All accents are the same. Uh, right, we're going to want to get this because this is plus 7 unity. Like, other ones are good. This one is useless to us. It's, oh, you can make a federation. Nobody likes us. It's a problem. It's not a problem. We're perfectly happy like this. Ringworld section restored. Excellent. In which case, we will restore another section. If we had the stuff, we don't. Hmm. Doesn't happen very often. Uh, Terra. Make me a glub and make it. Glubby? I don't know where I was going with that one. Habitable section A. Source. Server. Locus. Chassis. Um, I'll go with Source because that was the first one you wrote. Terminus. Oh, I like Terminus. Can we go Terminus? I mean, I could type it in, but I could also hit this button and repeatedly overshoot and then regret it. Axis. No, that sounds a little bit World War II. Uh, oh, God damn it, right? I'm going to type in the word Terminus. Terminus. See, that was a lot less hassle. Terminus A. Right. Unemployment? Where is this? Oh, Sosta Prime! Ah! You've got unemployment! What's that like? I need to go through the Sostas. I think there's stuff here that we haven't really uh, touched on particularly well. Uh, we'll put a power plant down or something. I don't know. At some point we'll go through the Sosters. Not right now, we're busy. Mega Warform's doing a pretty good job here. Colony emancipated. Yeah. Those Mega Warforms are just mashing the face. And... Now there are no more faces to mash. Right, embark. Uh, do we need to kill something over here? Probably not. We'll take a swing past, just to make sure they die. And then I think we'll hit... Nijligary thing, whatever it's called, I don't know. Uh, who else do we want to hit? You need to split up, probably into three, but I'll settle for two. Uh, lies, I won't. I'm gonna split you again. Alright, you follow you. And you jump to... Kuzum. And... You will need people to follow you. So, what do we have? I've got four war forms. It's not really enough. We're going to need actual war forms for this one. Uh, you could send someone after you, but... Just be a little bit, you know, it wouldn't really work. Um, what if we go and negotiate? Minus 45, really? You're not going to come back from this. You're just... You're dead men walking. I guess we'll group you up. Wait, the fourth is moving into the fifth, so we don't have a fourth anymore. That makes complete sense. Um, you know what? We'll tell that four to meet you here. And then when they get here... No, don't go through Henderson. That seems like a very, very bad... You know what? Sure. Go through Henderson. You can hit Henderson. Just 
make sure you get to Henderson first, otherwise it's going to be really, really awkward to explain. Yeah, I may have told you to jump into somewhere super dangerous, but I didn't mean it. Also, they're getting really excited about shooting a defenseless-ish uh, research hub. A little bit gung-ho. At least that can shoot back. Not for long, but it can. In theory. And now they're getting hyped up over another defenseless research hub. Right, land your army. Go blow up that one. And let's make sure that uh, Henderson is an interesting one. Have we got... Yeah, we've got the guys here. Good. And you're coming in nicely. Planetary invasion begun. Right. Let's watch that planetary invasion. Almost up to 70% war score. I don't know what they're waiting for to piece out on. Like, just me to ruin everything in their economy? I have no idea. I guess that's what we have to do. And crushed it. Aggressor colony emancipated. Next one. They're not even able to remotely stop us. They're still refusing. I I guess we give them points for spirit or something. System survey complete. Right. Almost ready to bomb uh, to invade after the bombardment. Little bit more. Right, System go. survey complete. Uh, you're still working on that one. You're working on that one. Oh, there we go. Invasion begun. Go for that one. Yeah, you got that. Construction complete. Any more minerals to do the whole ring world thing? A mineral income has definitely gone down. System survey complete. Kind of disappointing. We're really over capacity though, so can't blame it too much. Okay, how are we going with the invasions? That one's going fine, that one's going fine. Right, when you're done, move on to the next one. Aggressor colony emancipated. Right. Now, you're doing that one. Don't need to worry about you that much. Take on that one. Aggressor colony emancipated. I think we've got to hit like some other places. Maybe they're just getting like really confident that you know they're not we're not hitting the right enemy. Maybe that's the issue. Um, pop past were say hi to them. Uh, to do that, we'd have to jump in here and then into Swer just so we catch them and then. Trappist is a good one, because it's got three different stations. Okay, go have fun. Meanwhile, over here... Where's your army? Oh, there it is. It's fighting a research hub. Uh, how do I explain this? Research hubs don't really need fighting that much, but whatever, mate. Land the army. Construction complete. Now, it's only four war forms, but this is a pretty easy army to beat. A few defensive units. If you have any issues, I will sap you. Invasion begun. Still pretty slow, though. Yeah, hello. Where's your uh, transport fleet that should be with you? There they are. All 
Right, keep it up. You're getting there. System survey complete. Aggressor colony emancipated. Right. Buck. Head up the next world. They are very close to capitulating. Do you want to... Still minus 20. Okay, I'll just keep hitting you. It's not a problem for me. We'll destroy their frontier outpost there because I can. And they're being petulant. If they're going to be petulant, I'm going to take their toys away. Then I guess we'll hit up your capital. Because you haven't been hit yet. And i got to spread the love. Um, you're doing a bombardment over here. It's high time you land in an army. Begun. All right, you got this. Can I just like have another way to make them Building capitulate? Like, home. spray them with hallucinogens and drop Michael Bublé CDs on their head? I no idea. Just something that'll demoralize them. Uh, I guess we'll go to Umbracel or whatever it's called. Upsilon. The Pilie. I'm going to call it Umbrella. Go to Umbrella. Oh, look, a 10,000. Large fish. Ooh. As a fisherman went to search for more fish to harvest, they came across an amazing discovery. A massive school of large fish, and of course, caught as many as they could. Hmm. Influence? What? Influence. Influence. Straight up, good. 350 energies. And that's actually like complete. two and a bit months of income, admittedly, but it's 20 months of influence. So, yeah. Uh, how are you doing down here? Are you ready to invade? Not yet. Yeah, almost. Go for it. How about you? Yeah, you're totally ready. Someone's going to have to go kill this fleet when we're done. Or my people might do it for me. Hmm. Oh, hello. That's a 12k. Planetary invasion begun. Hmm. want to fight that. I want to get all the research. Right, go kill that. Then go kill that. I can't because you're in combat. Please tell me that you know we can do this after. Aggressor this. colony emancipated. You just kill the battleships faster, like faster, faster. There, right. Oh, they did take the order. Oh, sweet. Construction complete. Right, you embark, follow, go kill things. Aggressor colony emancipated. A hundred percent war score. I'm gonna try and kill a few more things though because I want the research. Because <laughs> I can do that. Uh, they're probably just gonna have to peace out though. But things are fun. When they blow up. Not piecing out yet. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. We are drawing our troops and ceasing military operations, targeting the Glub Glub assimilators. The best possible outcome. Yeah, there are better possible outcomes, but this was pretty good. Everything I could have wanted. Are you going to. There we go. I didn't think our blob would be this blobby, but it's pretty blobby. It's pretty damn blobby. We blob good. We blob good. Okay, uh, y'all gotta get back to south. Fair way. And I would like all of you, which is uh, quite a lot of you, 
to just sit there for the moment. Actually, I'm going to need to put people in places to make sure that people don't rebel and other stuff like that. Right. Let's start thinking about managing rebellions and also putting things into colonizable systems and stuff. What are you? I actually want to rebuild the century array. That's going to be kind of important to me. Um, okay. Right, for starters, can I just... I wish I could just track all debris. Instead, I have to go one from every system. Uh, I don't think we've had Roskin before. In doubt, tag it. We need one from every system because we're going to tell them on the system level to just scan everything in the system. But I can't really pass up the opportunity, even if they are mostly unimportant. Like, even this is fairly unimportant. But there might be something hiding amongst the rest that I miss. Impulse thrusters. Good in theory, but I have better. Because I fought the Fallen Empire and nicked all their tech. Like, if this was multiplayer right now, um, going to war with these people would be actually risky because they'd get the opportunity to pick over RX. Even if we only lost one Corvette, that would still give them uh, the opportunity to grab some tech. Again, I have better than all of this. But we'll pick it up. It's a shame there's no tachyon lances. I really thought there might be some tachyons. Um, science ship, stop everything you're doing. Uh, actually, just stop everything you're doing, go upgrade, because I want you to have jump drives. I wish I could just tell everyone to do that. Um, right, you can upgrade. You can upgrade. You can upgrade. You can't upgrade. Are you fully... You're still using a wormhole. Why are you using a wormhole? Why can you not upgrade? Whoops. Can't be... God damn it. Let's try that again. Please don't use a wormhole. Save. What's the shortcut for upgrade? There isn't one. Because jump drives are so much easier than wormholes. Also, the whole wormhole bottleneck. I just I really appreciate it not being a thing. It also did mean that I built over several hundred Corvettes and spammed them all at once, which filled up my list quite a lot. That was not the fun part. Uh, right, okay, we grabbed a load of stuff. What did we get that was way too much? Like, seven worlds. Okay, that's that's quite a lot of worlds. Let's go through them. Uh, okay. You need some transport fleet. Cool. That I get. Next. You need quite a bit of transport fleet. In fact, yeah. Uh, we'll land you. And you can also have troll drones. How about that? Does it make up? For, no, no, it doesn't make up for wanting to assimilate your entire population. Eh, some people are picky like that. Right, what about you? You can get patrol drones as well. Oh god, I'm lost. Where are we on the list? You. You get some as well. And I cannot afford to actually do any more patrol drones now. Okay, that'll have to do. Um, we're at number four. Number five. You get some as well. Number six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Eight. Right. 
Hopefully they won't complain. Okay, now. This all needs to be added to sectors. So Landcord, you're probably going to be the one taking over. Oh, no, there's Kalok. But Landcord could just take over for Kalok as well. And yeah, yeah, that's probably the easiest method. Uh, right. Sawomia. Come here. We're going to eat you up. Yoink. Right. I also want to bring this down. Grab these. How many are we over still? Three. Two. Where's the last one? Where is our last planet we're over? Silithia Prime. There we go. Close. Right. Now everybody go home and enjoy the rest period that we will have before we inevitably go to War of Fallen Empire because Ships upgraded. They're really sort of fight. We've got lots of tech. Some great stuff. Uh, science ships aren't upgraded yet. That's what we really care about. Ships upgraded. Okay. Uh, save up minerals until we can upgrade another section of ring. Maybe, uh, should we wait for the Sentry Array? Ships upgraded. Maybe. I mean, Sentry Array would be really helpful ships to see upgraded. every ship in the entire universe. Ships upgraded. Okay. Stuff is going on. Associate yeah, people are scared of me, obviously. I've just done a whole load of damage to this ships group upgraded. over here. Not much to you, and not any to you. You are, uh, I mean, other than your fleet. They are going to have a field day with this, though. You like a solo already? Yeah. Hmm. Good going. Uh, right. Science ships. Start doing science. And make sure to do the ones in their area as a priority. Because they will probably kick us out. I would say I could blame them. That I really can't. Right, over here. And then finally, up here. Delicious science. Right, oh, now where were we? Uh, I think people are moving home and we're building stuff and got a whole load of construction ships. Don't really know where those construction ships are going to go, but I mean, the stuff over here to build with them. Uh, sure. No idea what my accent was doing there. I was aiming for Australian. It did start off Australian and then it left, went vaguely near America, and then got sunk somewhere in the ocean. I'm not even sure which side of America. Probably above it in space. Because no one talks like that. Apart from me. Which would explain a lot of things. Uh, right. Hello. Hello. Please just tell me you're saving. It is... Unit lost. Society Research Unit Dan Jiggins has ceased functioning. It's been noted that liquid compound Dan Jiggins was experimented on needed to be tightly temperature controlled as its fumes are aggressively corrosive. No! Dan, Dan used to alive. Oh, there we go. Now you're dead. Um, that was not good. I don't like Dan being dead. He was actually researching the one of, of very few options which was useful, which was Sentient Perk. Now that's happened. It's a bit of a bummer. It's a bit of a shame, really. You get a good life out of him. Yeah, I don't really want to give you that. You kind of want... Needs you to be useful, not... I guess probably going to put like a level 4 person on it, but even then, you're probably going to die. Is 
I can't because you're on the reset. You know what? Screw it. I'm just going to put you in it. I don't have enough influence. Of course I don't. You know, I'll hire a temporary scientist. Fine. You, the youngest, you can be in charge. <laughs> how we pick people. Are you the youngest? You can be in charge. Not exactly how we meant to do interviews. Um, meanwhile... Are you back up here yet? No, still jumping. Right, once you get there, we'll group the fleets together and we'll take them in for a refit and repair and we'll also do an upgrade because we've got new thrusters. Okay, all of you group. You're not going to group up? Why are you not going to group up? Also, no, don't go down here. Go. God damn it. There we go. Now you're grouping up. And now you're doing some really weird grouping up. You could just group up next. You seriously, you're right next to each. No, fine. Handshake protocol it's Just activated. me. You don't need my star charts, and I can bargain for something for my star charts. They're pretty decent. Uh, Rito. Oh, what do I want to check? Probably going to want to build that ring world because we're going to be giving up something else to have. Beta Refuge under my control, so... Uh, that section. Start on that. A lot of war forms going to complete soon. There we go! It's <laughs> a lot of war forms. Science is looking good. Still researching the antimatter stuff. I'm very tempted just to boost our uh, physics research. Yeah, let's do it. It's expensive, but worthwhile. Will that apply at the end of the month, or...? I'm guessing, because that doesn't need to be increased. Uh, right. Why did I hire someone? I could have literally gone over here and been like, Hi, curator. Uh, could we recruit one of your scientists? Ah, you need your opinion higher than me. What, how do I get your opinion high? We're interested in procuring you star charts. Yes. Here is a load of stuff. Also, can we produce more star charts? Yes. Oh. We already had someone who really, really liked us. Oh well. Can recruit one of your scientists. Of course you should love your donation. Right. You. You're being kicked out. Uh, what I will do with you is probably just dump you in a research ship and tell you to go around. Because I actually do need people to just look at things. There's a lot of things to look at. Spaceport. Build me a science ship. Right. How big is our fleet now? When you all get together, which might take a while considering you're all going in weird directions. Like, seriously. Also, how laggy is this now? I need to, I need to kill more things, obviously, to smooth this out. So anyway. Construction complete. The only way. So the greater good. Look right, you're good. Uh, right. Which of you is me five star one? You are. Well, when you're done here, go do the research project here. This science ship. Kira. Uh, just automate exploration. There's a lot to do. They gave me the worlds, so they didn't give me the details on them. You'd think that some records would exist, but no, they purged them all. Now I have to pick up this mess. So unthoughtful. I am trying to purge them. Ah, not purge. Upgrade. Assimilate. Make better. But they don't see it like that, so meh. I think we're up to half a mil. 
on our fleet size. It's pretty good. Look at it, so slow. They like it. It means that we've got a good fleet. In the next update, they're introducing uh, max fleet sizes. I'm not exactly sure how that's going to work. That's a big change. I mean, it does. I need it's, it's to try and combat the death ball mechanic, but uh, we've got 200 corvettes, 100 destroyers, 50 corvettes, 30 battleships, and 30 capitals. That's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> nothing at all. Ooh. I want to be on the receiving end of that, I'll tell you that one. Uh, right. Now, before we end today, we're going to go through and have a look at what we've just got. Because I believe we have Graviton Thruster, which is a uh, level 6. This is a level three, 3. Yeah, that's a that's a big jump. It goes from 40% speed to 100%. Same for combat, and also the evade is uh, 15 as opposed to 6. That's... Graviton thrusters are pretty cool. Uh, also, that's yeah, that power is that's very frustrating. Damn. How far away are we on those? Three months. Okay, we'll wait three months. I do need that extra power generation. A lot. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> that's our fleet. <laughs> it stretches from the sun to Saturn. Almost to Saturn, I think. Certainly to Jupiter. That's just crazy. It's probably where you go and just say, you, Are you sure you couldn't have spent that on some sort of amazing welfare program to ascend everyone to another plane of existence? Did you have to just build ships with it? Seems a bit of a waste. You know, Salvage preserved. Yeah. We got ten physics points out of it. Are we sure we've got that physics buff on? Apparently. Does it feel like it? I guess we'll see it at the end of the month. Um pre sapiens. Salvage preserved. I'm going to exterminate pre-sapients. Uh, initial border status closed. First contact protocol Research peaceful. Complete. Full. None. Unrestricted wars. Oh, there's antimatter fusion. Sweet. And no, that doesn't seem to have gone up, so I'm going to turn off this. Alright, new research. I mean, I really want the peacekeeper point defense. But I also really want the grav lance. So that's going to take a very long time. Both of those will. Uh... Dark Matter gives me physics 20%. I think I have to go Dark Matter, because that will boost everything else so much. Alright. And now, with the new physics... Uh, the new, uh... Energy. I don't know what those hand gestures were about. Like, this is obviously energy. Uh, we can upgrade. So. Bam. Bam. I don't know what I'm going to do with 20 power. Maybe there is something we could do. I have no idea what. Just keep the power. Uh, right. Yep, I'm upgrading you. Uh, do we have another core? No, we do not. Destroyer. I don't believe we've got another core that's particularly of interest right now. Uh, do we have any fun point defense or anything that I'm not particularly aware of? No, probably better to have weapons on this one. So we'll put a medium on the back. And uh, we'll fill that full of phase spear guns, which is range 80. I mean, we could just go for the... No, phase spear guns probably better. Uh, right. Put the antimatter fusion reactor on the back there. Ideally, we want to get an afterburner on as well. Put in a massive ass thruster. Watch the evasion just skyrocket. It's pretty nice. Uh, and then we've got a parachute again. Because, of course, we've got a parachute. It wouldn't be fun if we didn't have a parachute. Uh, Seven power. What do we do with seven power? Uh, eat it? Maybe? Sit on it? I mean, what do you do with seven power? We want the 
advanced after bonus because that increases our combat speed pretty highly. And the evasion is also really nice. It, evasion is really nice. It's 9% evasion. I don't know exactly what we're meant to do here. I don't really want to take one of our shields away because they are very powerful. I guess I can if I have to. In which case we'll do that and we'll chuck an, uh, an antimatter thing here. Great, we've got a load of power left. It's that awkward point in the game where we've got so many things of mismatched tiers that uh, we can't really match them as well as we'd like. Uh, you, on the other hand, are doing pretty well. We can take that away, which means you get Debarian armor. 15 points of armor. That's nice. Now, here we're going to notice much bigger changes. Uh, so if we upgrade your engine, and we upgrade your antimatter, that's a lot of energy. Can't quite go for any more than that. And if I did add an animatic deflector, we would have two power left, actually. But... 20% extra armor. And if we, you know, we can't obviously do this because power, but if we did this again, getting a bit more from that. I will just say one for the moment. Uh, because I can't do any more. Yeah, that's worthwhile. And then on the bigger end, all the way down at our capital ship. Right. I can get rid of one. 74. Ideally, I do want to get rid of more than that. But then we're looking at, you know, killing off a lot of shields, and that's that's just not acceptable, straight up. Um, because we could try and get that Dabarian armor up to 90. Can't get any higher than that. That's still pretty good. How much is this going to cost to upgrade? My guess is a huge amount. Only 7.2. Not as bad as I feared. We're going to leave the episode here for today. Hopefully you've enjoyed. It's quite an interesting war of... Yeah, you're not going to do anything to me, so... Eh. I think next time we fight the Fallen Empire. There are equivalents still. Superior in total, that's mainly because of the attack advantage, which we will be using. Uh, it doesn't matter about your attack advantage. If you're equivalent to me in fleet power, in theory, it's not always the case, um, we should be okay. So... Probably going to wait until the upgrade, and then we might be able to beat him. So next episode, there is a possibility of a Fallen Empire fight. This one's going to be much more complicated, because it's not just one location. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven locations here to hit. Uh, we'll probably want to just jump into one of the peripheries, try and get them to come to us in a fight, rather than jumping into their fortified location. Just try and hit something to make them wobble. Is there anything nearby we could, like, poke you with? No. Okay. For now, I've been Erlysium. Uh, like, subscribe. Until next time, stay shiny. I mean, we could just go over here, by the way, and have a war with these guys, but eh, it would be funny to squash more people. But I kind of want to take. Okay, bye. <laughs>